Everyone has dreams, goals they want to accomplish, and the families who walk through the doors of Inclusion Winnipeg are no different. They have children, young and old, living with intellectual disabilities. And with the organization's help, they're seeing those family members reach goals once never thought possible. And pushing and holding into place, but for the first time, he felt able to try and move. Reading is one of the many things Erica O'Brien Kluchuk enjoys. And since joining this book club, she started doing something for the very first time, reading out loud. I've never done that once before, but now I got to. And now I feel comfortable reading people, reading in front of people. Between the shelves at the Pemina Trail Library, members of the Next Chapter Book Club take turns reading. If you had to die, no, I read me. Leader Deborah Dijkstra launched the program here two years ago. We provide a place for people who like to read to come and read with friends and it doesn't matter what their abilities are, whether they can read at all, but if someone enjoys books they're welcome to come and join us. Erica can't get enough. I like reading and I and I met new people. Now they're now my friends and they're pretty great. The 26 year old and her friends who participate in the weekly meetup also like to pop by Inclusion Winnipeg. It's just a really great organization with a lot of really great people. The local charity advocates for and supports children and families living with intellectual disabilities. And it's been instrumental in helping Deborah get her book club going, along with three others now in Winnipeg. Everybody can learn to be more than they are. And, um, and so this is a place that recognizes that. It's where Erica's mom, Karen, learned she didn't have to navigate the challenges they faced alone. There are all these things that are part of the parenting life of people with children with disability. They have resources here that help you with that. So it's not just the programming for the kids. It's, it's the stuff for the parents so that you can more help your kids and as they grow up into adulthood to be fully members of the community. Inclusion Winnipeg has been helping individuals with intellectual disabilities for 60 years, often when families can't find support anywhere else. Sometimes they are in the middle of a crisis and they have just feel like they have nowhere else to turn and somehow they find their way to us and then we're, we work with them and beside them. And it's entirely because of community support. The not-for-profit has been able to offer services as long as it has. Some of our funding partners, uh, like the Vipont um, Committee in the St. Charles Golf and Country Club, that have been supporting us for over 40 years. It is all um, donations that come to us that support our work. It's been remarkable, says Forbes, to see the milestones families are reaching today. Erica is thriving thanks to the organization and mom Karen now believes there will be a day soon when her daughter can move into a supported, independent living environment. It just helps when you're dealing with all the challenges that you face to know that other people care and they think it's important. No matter the goals, Inclusion Winnipeg is changing the way people see all abilities and how the people it supports see themselves. I never saw myself joining a book club and here I am. Nicole Dubay, CTV News, Winnipeg.